Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome back. Hope you're having an absolutely fantastic day. It is the battle of the auto reloader versus the auto loader today. And we're going to start with the auto reloader driven by Okino from the Gorilla Clan. Shout out to you guys driving his Progetto 65, the Italian tier 10 in a tier 10 9 game here on the Schweden map. And here he goes silently moving forward because there's no more sound and i mentioned this so many times it's so freaking annoying these replays just annoy the hell out of me now guys uh, you know, okay but we're gonna make the best of it we're gonna make the best of it there's no engine sound oh well why do we need engine sounds on replays leave in the comment section do you guys know how to turn the freaking engine sounds on i've tried everything and it doesn't matter i'll just do it silently it's a what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Well, uh, Mr. A Gorilla Clan member moves to the typical spot at the beginning and takes one. And how many shots was he able to load in his auto reloader before? Three. But he taked, he hit two out of the three because two out of three ain't bad. We got gun sounds. We got gun sounds, guys. We just don't have engine sounds. And it's like 75% uh, of the replays now. Just uh, there's no engine sound. Go on to the um, any replay now and try and play it and see what happens. And 75% uh, of the time you do not get engine sounds. Oh well. You can rewind the replay. You can hit things. You can, uh, I don't know, you can hit that. You can, uh, you can do whatever you want. Nothing happens. It just doesn't do it. He spotted a tortoise. He still does not have a full clip, but now he does. Oh, you poor tortoise. You've been tracked. And now you've almost been tracked again. And now it doesn't matter if you've been tracked because, well, you've been hit four times. <laughs> Daddy, I'm in a... Daddy, I'm playing your account. And I'm going to take the tortoise out for a spin. <laughs> Okay, son, just make sure that my W and 8 doesn't drop. <laughs> That's beautiful, isn't it? <laughs> the amount of time it took the tortoise to, to do this. He started like this. Just to turn to face his front towards the enemy and he was almost dead. <laughs> See, I'm in a good mood now. I saw a British... Assault tank destroyer get almost annihilated. It made me feel good. <laughs> One and two. Look, this guy knows the angles. Three and four. I need back to reloading. Boy, this tank, devastating. Devastating tank. Now, they nerfed the gun handling recently, but I don't see any problem. He's uh, running food. He had fantastic equipment. He obviously has a fantastic crew. This guy's got it equipped uh, probably about as good as it gets. Okay, guys? So, uh, I don't know if you should expect your Progetto 65 to perform as well, unless you've got it completely equipped. Uh, crew skills make a big difference, and I'm talking about snapshot, smooth ride. Uh, if you've got the field modifications fully done, right? All of them. So that you get a little bit more mobility, a little bit uh, better overall. I don't think, that actually doesn't help your gun handling. But it helps your maneuverability. Um, well, no, there's the, the things you can choose. There's the options you can choose. The field modifications. I don't know which ones he's chosen. The one that makes you aim faster. The one that makes the circle smaller. So there, there's, you know, yada, yada, yada. He's got it all. And he's moving from position to position. So that he can... T yeah, he did, that gun did not handle very well there, but can he... Oh, armor! Oh, he got him. Oh, and he, took, he finally took a hit in return. See, this guy knows the angles. He went to the initial spot, shot the tortoise, no more, uh, uh, no more targets. Went to the other spot, got the crossfire. Now he's uh, never staying in the same spot, not poking the ridgeline in the same spot, because that would be predictable. He's going to maneuver go stealth and then poke out somewhere unexpectedly 
But now he's doing the reverse psychology. He said, you guys think I'm going to poke on the other side, but I'm going to poke back here because I want to. And he's going to make it count once. And whoa, beautiful. Now he's spotted. He only spotted after he shot. And now he's making a move. Readjusting. Dipsy doodling. That's what you have to do. If you want to be consistently good, guys, you have to be unpredictable. This thing is unpredictable the way he's playing it. But this guy, it's now the predictable is going to happen. Let's see. How predictable is this? Whoa! He was going to do it, but he decided not to do it. Because look, look at the minimap. Look at all these guys back here. STRV, object. Oh. If he poked over that ridge line to clip that object, he w it would have hurt in the morning. I'm telling you. So he's just moving from one position to another on this ridge line. He's going to try and maybe get this guy in a crossfire. Can he? He's looking. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Maybe, 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 maybe. No, I don't think so. There's no angle here. Unless he... Re wait, wait. He's... T uh, yes, there is. And he's going to take two. He's spotted and he's going to take three. Gotcha. There's always a different angle, isn't there, guys? That is textbook beautiful gameplay there, buddy. See, me, like a Muppet, I would have poked over that ridge line to... Uh, to shoot that object 140 on the other side exposed myself and got shot by the object 268 the strv <laughs> and the other guy and then i would have started complaining to my team team you idiots how come you didn't help <laughs> okay make that gun handle beautiful one two oh this is just textbook guys boom ah uh, you've been auto reloaded Consider it an auto reload. And now he's going for the reload. Boy, this this tank is excruciating though when it's on a full reload, isn't it? When it's on a full auto reload, I should say. Devastating when it's got uh, uh, shells in the clip. And now he still only has one shot. That Reloading that first shot took a long time. Reloading the second shot took a long time. Just fire it, yes. He did that for one HP. He Kill stealer. Oh, and he's only got one shot. Now he wants two. He wants to just win. Oh, he took the shot. Because he knew he was spotted. Smart move. You know, uh, waiting for that second shot. That guy would have moved or he might have got hit. He, he knew he was spotted because that's a light tank, an RU-251 with good view range. So he just let her, he let her rip. Might as well get one, right, instead of none. And that's why this guy's playing the ridge line like a boss, just moving and dipsy-doodling and just showing up cleverly in different positions just poking seeing who's there it's still a close game it's only a what they're up by 1495 damage they're not winning by a lot his teammate in the object 777 is pinned behind that rock because he can't he can't push forward versus those guys so he, what is he going to do he's going to take the hill and i think he's got a a line on this Udez, just a little, a little bit higher, little bit higher, just a little. Oh, oh, he's pro. Is it? Is it a blind kill? Oh, a little bit higher. Oh, okay, he's dead. No problem. No problem. Okay. Do you need to go up the hill now? You're winning nine six. Why not just scoot across? Well, because you'll get uh, detected, and he doesn't want to get detected. Does he have shots here? Whoa. A dream come true, guys. He's aiming for the track wheel. He actually penned it. Boom. Oh! Somehow that second shot did not pen. Trolled. Snap it. And it didn't. <laughs> did you see the bloom on that aim circle while he was on the move? The gun handling has been nerfed, but I noticed that when he fully aims... It's behaving fine. And that's typical for almost every tank in World of Tanks. Like if you fully aim, it generally goes pretty close to what you're aiming at. Unless you have like terrible signals. Uh, but uh, on the move and snapping, I don't think this thing can hit on the move or snap very well anymore. It used to be able to and I think it was just... Well, it didn't, it didn't overwhelm the uh, statistics. So uh, the Wargaming just decided they were going to nerf it. I mean, it, it was powerful, no doubt. 
It was powerful, but you didn't see like this tank dominating, uh, ending up with the uh, top results for uh, you know all the top results. It didn't, but uh, they nerfed it anyway, you know, because it's uh, well, it's not Russian and it was doing pretty good. And now he can take one shot, and he's only going to get two, I think. Boom! He went. He goes for the track in his. Oh, he gets three, and he did, and that shot did not track him. After. Uh, I thought that the Jagdpanzer 100 you got tracked and used his repair kit. Oh well, okay, might as well just take him out now. Boom! Why not? Why not take him out? Why not take him out? I'm not sure why that shot did not track him. Once the track's been damaged, I would have thought he'd be able to track him every shot, but he did not. And it's still, still guys, there's four, well, two TDs and two SPGs. So there's a lot of HP for him to still farm. And he's feeling pretty confident now with five kills. And, whoops! Yes. Oh, he's just got a sliver there. Can he aim it? Yes. One. And... Oh! Denied! Okay, he's... Be now, he's approaching really well here with the rock protecting him from the last known positions of the enemies. There's this guy. Oh, and it's beautiful. It's beautiful. He's got uh, one. Oh, it's beautiful. Beautiful. Beautiful! Beautiful! <laughs> it's 8,700! And there's still three enemies left. There's still a lot of HP. Finally, the leopard has put his big boy pants on. He's taken off his mommy's dress. He's put his big boy pants on and he's arrived. So there is that. Now, does he let Mikey go? Or does he just move? you got a lot of HP, guy. I mean, uh, you could just go. But there is an, uh, an FV3... No, there's... Hey, you got a lot of HP. I thought there was a Death Star, but there isn't. Just an object. It's just an object, buddy. But he's waiting for his gun to load, is what he's doing, guys. I'm, I'm talking here, but he is waiting for his gun to load. Boom. 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 Beautiful. And now, the excruciating wait now. Okino, don't you wish that you... That your gun reloaded faster, you could be farming all this damage, just waiting, 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 and he might as well take it. Victory! Victory. And boy, that damage added up quick here. He ends up acing the tank with 10,042 damage and 7 kills. And he, uh, he did pretty good on credits too. Well done, my friend. The challenger today is Will I Am from the No Mod Clan. He's playing the auto loader, not the auto reloader. It is the Czech tier 10. He's got excellent matchmaking. He's top tier versus tier 9s and 8s. You should be able to chew your way through this conglomeration of enemies easily. And now we do have engine sounds. I don't know if you can tell the difference. Can you tell the difference? Let me know if you can actually tell that there were no engine sounds in that previous game. And then leave your comments. Who is more deserving of the epic win they will have? And I'll give you a spoiler alert here. It is not going to take Will I Am that long to churn through the HP on this enemy team. He is just like a boss. He's moved into a position here. Now look at the difference in the gun handling of this gun versus the other. A little less alpha. A little less alpha in my life. But look at the reload now. You get the four shots like the Italian one. And he's done 1,200 damage, and he's got about 800 spotting assist. Okay? He's moved aggressively here. No one's countered him. No one's moved down the 9 line in the bushes. But now he has 4 shots. Again! Wow. 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 I say wow. I think I prefer the Czech uh, tier 10 medium to the uh, Italian one. Now I know the Italian one, um, uh, it, pumping out its four shots does a little bit more damage, but the reload's excruciating, right? And the gun handling on this one, mwah! Th almost 3,000 damage in two clips with the fire and 2,296 spotting assist. Look where he is. L look at the minimap here, guys. I'll show you something. If someone had driven down here on the enemy team, you know, to what, any of these bushes here, I think there's a bush there and a high area there. Could have at least spotted him when he fired his gun.
but no one took map position on this side and it's just sometimes you know if you don't have map position guys if your team does not uh, get map position you end up in a crossfire and you just get smoked there's nothing you can do and this guy is just super patient He's not going to move. Why? Because he's a medium tank and when he moves he has less concealment. He's just very patient. Just wait. Just wait. Slowly, slowly decide where to go. Inch forward. Keep the bushes between you and the enemy. Can he poke this and not get spotted? Yes. And look at this. Can he? Can he? Can he? He switches to... Oh, the, the perk that switches, he's a full heat clip now. He pressed the button and he got a full heat clip to go through that guy's turret. Can he do it now? Let's watch. A little bit more, just a little bit more. Yes, there you go. Jedi mind trick. Two. And he's wondering, what? Wow, okay. Okay. Not bad. Oh, he went for a reload. Unfortunate. Yeah, he could do this. He's just moved to a flank. The enemies have left this flank over and they are paying for their stupidity. That's why they are winning the game by 8,000 HP, all right. But guys, he's personally responsible for five, six, seven, he's personally responsible for 8,000 in this game. I think he's proxy spotted now. He's done about 5,000 damage and he's done about 2,000 spotting assists. So he is personally responsible for the lead that his team has, and that's a, a blind Muppet who proxy spotted him, but just ignored him. <laughs> you know, <clears throat> being a Muppet is bad, but being a blind Muppet is worse. <laughs> so the team's winning by a little less than 8,000 HP, and this guy's responsible for 8,000 of it. So this is the difference right here. If you're thinking, oh, it's just easy, the enemies are no good. Well, the enemies seem no good because he's made a mockery of them, okay? He's got six, seven, he's got 8,200 combined and they're winning by 7,600 7, HP. He's basically responsible for the win, for the uh, the difference in, in the game right now. And he's going for the reload. The, the, the enemies are still ignoring him. No one's moving to counter in any way. And he's pulling off a beautiful medium tank flanking maneuver here. He's gonna keep going. Uh, their lead is diminishing now as his team withers away in the city. He keeps moving forward. There's going to be some people up there. Do you think there's any people camped up in that little ledge? The ledge at A4? Let's see. He moves forward. He's going to get them in another cry. Now, if there's no one on that ledge, this team deserves to be annihilated. Look at this. Look at this. It's just beautiful. Gun handling. Gun handling. Gun handling. Gun. Oh, that was a delayed... That took a long time for Six Sense to go off. Ay, caramba. It went off, but it took a long time. So he must have been detected, what, on the second shot or something? And now he's, he's detected, but he does not care. He's still loading. Look how fast. And he's got four shots again. Might as well shoot the house down and get and plant three into the tiger. Shoot the house down, yeah, they'll shoot the house down and plant one, two, and you only needed two, and uh, plant one in the STB one. Come on, give the STB one uh, payback for it. Oh, the STB one is dead. Go for the reload. Oh, Kunzi Panza, Kunzi Panza alert. How long has this game gone on? To? Six minutes, guys. Six minutes, and he's at eight thousand. Oh, look, hello, <laughs> the surprise. He's thinking, what? What the hell were you even doing there? If you didn't... When he was spotted. When he shot the STB-1 and he was spotted. How could that guy not react? Like I said, guys, being a Muppet is bad. Uh, but being a blind Muppet is worse. Ay, 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 okay. Hey, 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 hey. Kill steal! He finishes with 8,945 damage, 5 kills, and he made credits as well. Leave some comments in the comment section. Let me know who you think was more deserving of his victory. 
And which particular medium tank do you think uh, is the better perform performing tank? The auto loader, the Czech tier 10, or the auto reloader, the Italian tier 10? Let me know your comments. I'll read them and I will catch you guys on the next one.